This is Bob with Film the Police. I noticed the uh, Clackamas County, I follow a Clackamas County canine unit here. It looks like it's a traffic stop. <laughs> Let's see what, what we can get out of it. Right. What about across the street? You go across the street, that's fine. All right. And here comes another sheriff's deputy. So he's gloving up.
Oh man. Did you glove up? Did you glove up? Yeah? Oh, my, uh, warm gloves. Oh, okay. It's a bit chilly in my fingers are freezing. Yeah, what's this guy got, a warrant? Uh, I'm not too sure, actually. I just got here after the fact. Hmm. Yeah, I don't get too much trouble from Clackamas. I get trouble every once in a while from Portland, but Portland's basically calmed down. But the transit cops, they're not too happy at me right now. <laughs> so you're gonna be sergeant pretty soon? Me? Yeah. Oh, no. no? Uh, that's not my day. <laughs> I'm happy where I am. Yeah. Yeah, this way. Um, I was just going from the town center down 82nd and I seen the canine unit and I'm like, well, I don't have, there's, Portland's basically got no calls going on, so I go, well, I'll follow the canine unit. And we, and when we turned up there, I seen the lights down here, so. Gotcha. Right place at the right time. Yeah. I mean, they did have a stop on 162nd and Stark, a traffic stop, but something tells me, uh, from uh, Audi Road down here to uh, 82nd Audi Road to 162nd Stark, I think I'd miss that traffic stop. <laughs> mall pretty crazy right now? Huh? Is the mall pretty crazy right now? Oh, I didn't even go in. I just used that as a turnaround spot. Gotcha. I'll, I'll go from uh, Gresham down to 82nd and then go out to the mall and then back around. That way I can catch Clackamas County sometimes and I can catch the state police. There you go. But yeah, I was really hoping this would be a dog track. And then when I seen them there with the fence, I'm like, dog track! <laughs> yeah, not so much this time. Yeah. Chris still around? He's in prison. Oh, he already went? Yep. I thought it was uh, going to be a couple of months before he went. No, he, uh, he'll be out in February. Okay, so he's almost done. Then. Yeah. Yeah, the judge only gave him uh, six months in prison and six months home confinement. Gotcha. So, when he goes home, I'll probably take my computer over there and let him... Uh, Load up the videos and... I'll do all the editing for you so you can still be involved? Yeah. There you go. <clears throat> Think he's gonna come back out and do it when he's done with the... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and he'll be out with... He'll be out with anger. <laughs> So, yeah, he can't do it on home confinement because he's supposed to stay in the house, but once he's off that, he, he'll be able to do it. Is there another guy with you guys? Uh, I think I saw someone else, but it wasn't you or Chris uh, filming out here too long ago. There's Ruthless. Ruthless? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't get out and talk with him or anything, but it looked like a new guy hanging out, so. Well, Ruthless has been filming for about eight months. That might be him. It was, it was like super recent. Though. Yeah. Then we got Keith Davis. We got Eli. You all tend to stay up on towards Portland? Or? Mostly. I don't even consider Eli a cop watcher. I mean, he goes out and videotapes the cops, but he does a lot of other things, too. Um, so... Mm -hmm. 
I mean, a cop watcher has to at least sometimes go out and film the police. Right. He might get out once a month. <laughs> Are you out every night, or how often do you come out? Just about every night. You have to keep busy. Yeah, I uh, um, I load ten videos a day on my YouTube channel, okay. and I usually do that in the morning. So, but yeah, I I try to stay out and try to do that. I've had people ask me, hey, you ever see an officer get injured or down or anything? I go, no. <laughs> then they ask me, what's the craziest video I've seen? I go, oh, I've had people pull guns on me before. Had, I was there when Eli got stabbed in Gresham. So. Now it's a, That's one thing that I, that's one thing that constantly goes through my mind a lot when I'm not cop watching is what what's my attitude going to be if I'm sitting here say you you're doing a traffic stop and you get shot right and I call 911 they say um, the police are the police are busy doing something else medicals uh, tied up um, Am I going to put you in my car and take you to the hospital? If so, it would either be uh, Emmanuel or be OHSU. So, of course, I'd rather the medical do it, but yeah, that's why I'm saying that. But, yeah, <laughs> but the thing is, something crazy could be going on. Yeah, if something's going on, you know. So, Also depends on the wound. If it's a flesh wound in the arm, I'd probably not. If it was a chest wound, a neck wound, or life, what I consider life-threatening, I'd probably get you in the car. You gonna be out pretty late today? I don't know how late I'll be out. I'll probably be out to about. 12, maybe one. Do you just depend on how busy we are? Or? Oh, there's a lot of things. How busy the police are. If the police aren't busy, I'll go in early. Um, if the police are really busy, I'll stay out. Um, if uh, there's, if there's, say for instance, in an area there's a someone going around attacking people. I'll I'll hang out in that area to see what I can see, you know. But yeah, people ask, what would you do? It's like it's a catch-22. I mean, it's one of those things that if you can get medical there in a short period of time, and if, if it's non-life-threatening, then you deal with medical. But if it's going to take medical all day to get there then you got to do what you can do to save a life. Exactly. <laughs> I'd have the Clackamas County Sheriff's deputies hating me forever on that. Why did you load a wounded deputy in your car? <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> But I realize most of these deputies have wives and kids at the house and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, why, uh, why risk a father not going home to his wife and kids? It's a good way to look at it. Yeah. <clears throat> so. <clears throat> Looks like the dog's doing article search. 
<laughs> if I remember right, that's going before the Supreme Court. What's that? Oh, the thing on canines going before the Supreme Court. Yeah, the handler would know more about that than me. 